Good morning, good afternoon, and good evening. This is Ninth Legion, and we're going to be playing some more Fractured Space today. Uh, we're going to be taking the Hunter Attack Craft out for a spin. This has a nice little blink ability to skip you through space. It's got some missiles, and it's got a lot of cannon. So we will give this a go and jump straight in. Okay, we're just waiting for the match to start. So, as you can see, we've got cannon, which are fairly rapid fire. Uh, we've also got a blink ability, which I can skip through space and time with. Uh, we've also got some long range missiles, which I can't show you without actually anything to target, but here we go. We are coming into the match, so yeah. We've got missiles on one, a detect on two, uh, leech drones, which will perform, you know, bothering attacks on an enemy craft. Left mouse button is our cannon, and right mouse button is blink. Point defense and jump drive are the usual spaces. Looks like we're pushing Alpha quite heavily. Two of our team have gone there. Two others are still hanging around. I'm going to go to Beta and start taking that side. If I meet a lot of resistance, I will probably have to pull out on my own. I won't be able to do very much, but here we go. Now the crew I've got on here, I've, we've got a good turn rate, but not such great speed, so we'll make good use of the blink ability to jump ourselves forward like that. It's got a 18 second recharge, uh, which isn't great. Someone else has joined us. Can't see them. Okay, we've got a flagship coming in behind us. That is always good to see. Flagships are... they've got a lot of health, and they do a huge amount of damage at point blank range. Alright, okay, we are capturing. Now, there is a dynamic system to this. As the match progresses, capturing takes less time, which means towards the later stages of the game, it gets very fast-paced as territory is traded back and forth. So I can see in Alpha, there's at least one enemy ship, and there is someone here. Someone is capturing the other end of uh, the beta sector. Now, my scan, which I just fired off there, with that pulse of energy, I can't see anyone, but I believe... They must be... Yeah, they're going to be on the other far side of these rocks. Oh, and in fact, they fired off a whole bunch of missiles. They must be a flagship class. It doesn't look like he's activated his point defence. Oh no, there he goes. Oh, we've actually got a number of ships, but we have captured that first sector. So I'm going to move up and support Sergeant Dacker as best I can. Looks like we've lost someone already. There's a brawler. I do not want to get in too close to him. Activate my point defense. Take the heat off some of these bombers, hopefully. Okay, missiles and leech drones are away, targeting him. I want to bring my bow round so I can fire four guns. That will do the most damage. There we go. going to keep closing. I'm not going to use my blink ability because I might need that to get out of here in a minute. Yeah, we are getting very close to this guy and we are going to get punished for it, unfortunately. He is... Oh, he tried to jump out, which was a bad choice with me that close behind him. Um, you take a lot more damage when you are in that position. Uh, attempting to jump, I'm not sure if it doubles or triples the damage you take, but it's uh, it's always a bad move. Missiles away on this guy. Yeah, the enemy team is responding. We've got quite a number of them coming in. Let's see what we can do here. Got to watch out for that flagship behind me. If he gets too close, I will be in trouble. Brawlers do have a lot of close range firepower. I do not want to be... Yeah, he's already hit me hard. We need to get out of here. Okay. As you can see, our health has plummeted. And now three enemy ships out there. They are still after us. Unfortunately, yeah. We've got one guy left there, but he is... He's not having a very good day. There are 
fighters. I'm not sure if they're coming for us. Looks like someone is coming over the top. I wonder if I can get some missiles on him from here. Or they're going to go straight into that rock. No, they are going straight into that rock. Try and keep this asteroid between us. Fortunately, I've come straight out at the uh, uh, flagship there. So, we'll drop missiles, put some fire into him, and then try and blink away from the brawler that's coming in behind us. There we go. Can still do some good from here, just want to stay away from that brawler. Unfortunately, Sergeant Dacker is getting quite badly screwed up. Launch a few more lean drones, put some more missiles into there. A couple of them have unfortunately hit the uh, I think I can kill him. I've just, I'm just i going to have to get in close to do it. There we go. He's dead. Now I'm going to make a run for it because that brawler is behind us. Not close enough to target him, unfortunately. Uh, I believe that might be the frigate. I'm not entirely sure. This is quite a... Uh, Heavy battle. I am going to take this opportunity to head back to base, though. Uh, we took quite a lot of damage there. But we did some good. We got some kills in. Did some damage. Now, where's the base? There we go. Okay, I'm just going to quickly... Yeah. Use my blink ability to get me right there. And we will start healing ourselves up. Anyway, it doesn't take as long as it looks initially. That amount we heal by... Uh, goes up the longer we're in here. So there you, you can already see it's jumping up from a few hundred to 500, a thousand, 2,000 per tick. There we go. So we can now go back to the fight in Beta 1. There we go. I always seem to come out of uh, FTL facing the wrong way. But we're going to use our blink ability and join up with the rest of our fleet. Looks like we do have an ally in the enemy base already, which is good. We have, however, lost most of Alpha, Alpha, and we don't look to have anyone there. That's not a good sign. There's an enemy ship, though. Can't target him. He's still quite far away. We'll keep blinking closer. And there we go, missiles away. It is a bruiser, so I am not going to get too close. But we might be able to get some hits with the guns at this range. He is jumping. Let's see if we can't get some hurt on him before he goes. Yeah, we didn't kill him, but we did hurt him. So he's going to be out of the fight for a little while. I'm going to move into here. I won't use my blink ability because I'm so close. There we go. We are capturing this. Let's turn ourselves around so we're going to be facing the right way. Now the gas facility in the centre does give us fleet bonuses which will allow us to upgrade our ships. What the hell? I'm being shot by my own team. I'm not entirely sure why. Um, that's a bit weird of them. So I'm going to go through Gamma and then move on to Alpha, because we need some support there. If we lose Alpha, they're going to start jumping directly into our base. In fact, they might be moments away from doing that. Sergeant Dacker is still with us. We can't seem to shake the guy, but he's doing quite well, so I shan't complain. Once he's in here, this capture will speed up, and we can see about moving to either Alpha 1, or I believe they've just jumped to home. I believe they've just jumped to our home. There's now three of us here. Yep, I can see them in our home base. We've got someone there. Hopefully that one guy can handle them. There's now two people in our home base. What we want to do is quickly 
capture this area. Oh, there is an enemy flagship there. Let's missiles and guns on him. Jump in close. Looks like he is trying to run for it. There we go. See, at this range, we are doing a lot of damage. That might have been a mistake there. He's going to go down very quickly. Fight at home might not be going that well. Looks like we lost one friendly ship, but they have now... Yeah, no, okay, we have got our home base still. Let's blink forward. Start capturing some of these bases. Drop a detect out, just see if there's anyone too close. Okay, we are capturing this base. And you can already see how much faster it is now after only 10 minutes in the game. Almost got this one. There we go. We'll start moving on to the next. So, so far we're not doing too badly. We ourselves have got some good kills and not too many deaths. If any, I'm starting to lose track now. I don't think I've died at all, you know. Um, but we haven't done any damage to the enemy base. Now, they haven't done any damage to us. So, we are going to capture this quickly. There we go. Let's... Ooh. That is a sniper. I want to get close to him so he can't target me with those big-ass guns of his. Activate point defense and take out those missiles. Right. Now this guy's about to have a bad day. He's almost dead. Yep, there we go. Sniper has got to stay away from the enemy. They shouldn't really lead into a, uh, a zone where they haven't got any friendlies. They didn't know who was here when they arrived, and they paid for it. Oh, heal drones. That's nice to see. Good play by the support guy there. And right, let's jump to the enemy base. See if we can't start turning this around. If you heard that horrible cracking sound, that was my knuckles. I kind of apologise, I guess. There we go. We do have an enemy. We do have several. That guy is close. It's a brawler. Yeah, we're going to pay for this. We are too close to him. But if we can back off a bit... Stay out of range of his guns. Let's jump away a bit. Yeah, he's taking a lot of fire, which he's not going to enjoy. Our health is still pretty good. May have panicked though a bit, might have not needed to be as worried there. We are now in the capture circle for the enemy base. He's down. Flagship up above us. Again, flagship is going to be quite dangerous at this range, but I want to get to the sniper beyond him. Jump in behind. There they are. Start putting fire down where he can't hit us. Going to put some drones on him, if we can. Missiles away. Want to get... There we go. Look at that damage. He is going... He is moments from death. There we go. Damn. There's a brawler on us. Get away from him. And unfortunately, our fellow hunter did take us down there. We took a lot of fire. I think we managed to capt capture a smidgen of the enemy base. But yeah, we just didn't have enough support there. Um, I'll just pause the recording while we respawn in. So, see you in a second. Okay, and we are back. Saved you a minute of your lives by not making you watch me respawn. So yeah, we captured 3% of the enemy base there with that little attack. 
But that's 3% more than we had last time, so not going to complain too much. Looks like we have some fleet upgrades to grab quickly, so see how much our health goes up to. Yeah, just going to just slowly ramp its way up with each tick. 14,000? 13,850 health. That's not terrible. Someone is capturing Gamma. We could go take a look at that. Uh, we've got an ally there, and there's only one of them. So yeah, let's jump in and help that. Uh, beta and Alpha are both contested at the moment, so we're not in too much risk. What have we got? We've got a flagship. Well, he's already damaged. Blinking close. Start putting some gunfire on him. There go our missiles. Yep. Oh, and that's our friend Sergeant Dacker, who we always seem to be around at the moment. So we can't capture the gas facility at the moment. So we will need to go somewhere else. He's Sergeant Dak is going to beta. Let's go to beta. It is the one we hold the least of at the moment. There we go. There is one enemy out there. I did just see them. They may have jumped out. They may not have. There's now three of us here, so we shouldn't have too much trouble. Push on and start capturing these mining facilities. Use the sniper mode to see if we can't see anyone moving around. No, can't really. The sniper mode is useful, but I like being able to actually see my ship. They're kind of cool designs. They they have a nice aesthetic to them. The models are nice and sharp. And overall, I mean, the graphics in this game are pretty cool. We've got another hunter with us. Let's blink forward a bit and speed this up, shall we? Oh, can't go too far. There we go. Start capturing this point. Enemy flagship rushing in. Not the best of plans. He used his boost ability to speed up there. Uh, but he is going to pay for that. Ooh, he's trying to jump out. Let's do as much damage as we can. He is down. That's good. That brawler's now on his own. Now, I don't like facing brawlers. They do a mean ton of damage. But we might have got this guy banged to rights. He's trying to jump. That's a bad choice in this position. There we go. He is down. Let's see if we can't start capturing this node. Okay, this looks pretty good. Oh dear, Alpha has gone to hell while I was not paying attention. We've got enemy ships in the home base. We need to go home. Okay, where's the fight? Over there. Let's get in close. I believe that's a flagship. Might, is that a flagship or a destroyer? I'm not sure at this point. I've only been playing the game this weekend, so I, I really do know nothing. Bombers are out, so let's activate our point defence. There is a sniper. Damn, that sniper is going to screw us if I can't get in close, but... Got to kill the guy who's capping the base. There we go, he's down. Jumping close to the sniper. Hi, you're about to have a bad day, my friend keep moving so that they can't get the big guns on us. Point Black Missile Barrage. Yeah, this guy is about to have a very bad day. And by bad day, I mean die. Okay, we do have a friendly in the enemy base, which is pretty good. But I want to go to Alpha and secure that node so they can't jump straight through again. Right, jump in here and capture this. There we go. And you can see now just how quick it is to capture stuff. The game really becomes very fast and fluid. Okay, got one. Jump forward again. I think actually our abilities may also... There is an enemy ship over there. 
I could just see him. Yeah, looks like a brawler. I don't have any allies here. I do not want to face a brawler on my own. Not in the stock hunter. I've yet to win that engagement. However, I do have much longer range. He's he's jumping out actually. Surprises me. Don't know where he's gone to. He might have gone to the gas facility. So let's keep going and capturing these mining facilities. They'll do us some good. But yeah, it appears our abilities as the game progresses also uh take less time. Our blink now seems to be taking almost six seconds, which is insanely fast something we'll have to bear in mind. You get used to only being able to use it so much and then... no actually maybe 10 seconds. But yeah you get used to it taking 18 seconds or whatever and then suddenly that changes halfway through. Looks like we are losing the flight at Gamma. Oh I jumped too far. Okay well I'm gonna move on to actually take the last Alpha base so our team can start pushing through again. Only they are leading. They have... what is that? They've got 22% of our base, us having 18% of theirs. Okay. Oh, what the hell was that? That is a flagship. Yeah, we need to get out of it. He did us a lot of harm. But he's also taking a lot of fire. There are two hunters. Got to maximise our damage potential here. Point blank, straight on. Oh, damn it. Well, he's gone down as well, but unfortunately we did die, and that looks like a... yeah. Okay, our ally did jump out there, so hopefully they can escape. We've got another minute to wait before we're back in the game, so I'll just pause quickly. Okay, we're back. We're at our home base. Now, they have taken the entirety of Beta, and here we go, they are jumping into attack. So, let's start seeing what we can do. That, oh, it's a sniper. Well, that might well be a mistake for you, my friend. If I can get out of the range of his guns before he kills me. I'm trying to blink, but it's not quite ready. There we go. Oh, God. There's another capital ship there. Okay. Damn it, that sniper managed to turn around. We have got to get in close and take him out. Well, we got the sniper, but unfortunately it did kill us doing it. Not much we can do when there's that many enemy ships. Yep, and now they are going to start capping our base. Um, we won't... There's a good chance the map match is going to end before I respawn. So we will change perspective and start watching some of our teammates and see how well they do. It is actually quite a pretty game, I have to say. They are, they've done a very nice job. I think this is a UK team from Guildford, if I read right. And, um, yeah, it's a pretty game. It looks good. I'm, I'm very impressed with what they've actually done. Looks like my team does have this in hand. Yeah, that last guy's going to go down. I don't think we lost any more of our base, so... Yeah, apart from us dying, that wasn't terrible. There we go, we are back in the game now. Blink forward quickly and see if we can do... You know, we want to stop this guy as quickly as we can. He is... yeah, he is capping the base. Let's use some missiles on him. There we go, he's jumped down there. They are now at 29%, so they are leading. 25 minutes into the game. 
try and turn to get all turrets on him. There we go. Yep, and he's down. We're kind of in him, which is a bit alarming. Okay. Let's go to the gas facility in Gamma and see what we can do. Looks like I'm not going to be alone here. Yeah, there is an enemy ship on the other side. McRip. Not sure what he is, but we're just going to start firing at him. Oh. Yeah, he's a brawler or a bruiser. I've suddenly forgotten what they're called. Yeah, he's going to start hitting me. Now, to be honest, I don't need to get close to him and engage him. I've got longer range missiles and he can't hit me at this range, which I don't think he's realised. So, now he's focusing on the flagship. I can jump in close again. Missiles away and start putting turret fire on him. There we go. That should be a good assist kill. Sergeant Dacker did take a lot of damage there, unfortunately. Excellent. And we now have gas power. We're going to jump to Alpha. See what we can do. There are definitely enemy forces there. There's at least one guy. It's a sniper. Let's see if we can get in behind some cover here. There we go. Oh, he has hit us with a spotting drone and some missiles by the looks of it. That's annoying. Now, I've lost sight of the enemy ship. So, we are going to have to peek up. There he is. Right. Got to use our blink ability to get him close before we can snipe us down. There we go. Put some leech drones on him. There we go. Like I said before, the sniper is very powerful, but it's got to be used at long range. I honestly don't think you can just use it solo like that. You've got to be with people. Okay, I'm going to quickly capture this station, get the mining resources up, and then I'm going to have to jump home and get repaired, because we are quite badly damaged after that little skirmish. Okay, let's jump home and heal. There we go. Alright, blink towards the station as quickly as we can. Get ourselves inside, and there we go. Should start healing any second. There looks to be a big fight forming up in Beta. So as soon as we're healed, I think we're going to head there. There we go. Let's head to Beta. Looks like it's a three-on-three three fight. There's a brawler. some missiles on him. Do not want to close with him. Yeah, there's actually four of them out there. He might be, yeah, he's in cannon range. So we'll start putting some on him. Not quite sure what the other team is made of at the moment. We're both hiding behind this rock. He's very nearly dead, though. Yep. That was some good work from our other teammates. 
Let's move in close. Alright. Enemy team is taking a lot of damage. What's left? One flagship behind us by the looks of it. Uh, he's jumping. You can just see how much damage we do when they jump like that. Okay. Nice little fight. We didn't take too much damage. Made some good progress. Oh, and he has launched some healing drones. I um, wonder if I get close enough, they will be nice enough to heal me. Maybe they are probably targeted on a specific ship. So it's not that simple. Okay, we very nearly got this base. Okay, yep, we're going to push straight onto the enemy base. Right now they can't get to our base, so hopefully we can turn the fight around. Ooh, that, he is in a very bad place. He's already taking a lot of damage. Somebody is shooting at us though. But that yeah, he's going to be down. Okay, we're doing pretty well. There's a lot going on. But we are capturing the enemy base. 60% now. If they don't do something to stop us, we've got this match in the bag. Turn and get my forward guns on this guy. Excellent. There we go. We won. So let's see. We got in our hunter 10 kills, died 3 times, 9 assists, and 15 captures. That, I'm very happy with that. That is really good. 15 captures. I don't even recall capturing that much stuff, but I shan't complain. I do enjoy the hunter gameplay. It's fun and fast. And wow, this video has already got up to 33 minutes. That's quite impressive. Okay, so we picked up a nice amount of rewards there. 2,000 character experience, plus 1,144 bonus. Uh, a presence booster, I'm not entirely sure what that means. 27,590 credits. Yeah. Very happy with that match. That was fun. Anyway, Thanks for watching, leave a like, leave a comment, feel free to subscribe to the channel, and hopefully I will see you later. Bye!